can almost remember it sometimes. And it's gone. Like you never sang it at all. Maybe. Everything before Mephisto is... distant. A dream. That turned out to be my life. I remember she loved me. And that's enough. It needs to be enough. We came here for a reason. Knowledge. The vault's bound to have something we can use against Mephisto. Let's go. Smell. You don't forget it. Oh. Lorath was here. Left his workbench a mess. Again. Let's take a look around. He may have left something useful behind. From my mouth crawled hatred. Uh, is this? Rathma's prophecy. Lorath always dismissed it. What would change his mind? Hmm. Can't believe you actually found her. Who are you? Friend of a friend. I've been following you since you arrived in the peaks. On Prava's behalf. She wants to see you. Prava's knights hunted Nayrel across half of Sanctuary. Do you take us for fools? I would have asked the same. Not so long ago. Then Prava saved my life. She's changed. Or maybe the world has. Either way, give her a chance. She's waiting for you at Laura's place. We can't keep running. Let's hear what Prava has to say. <laughs> A wanderer? And a heretic, both. Welcome. If something happens, I'll be ready. I hear Ulivar is dead. By your hand? Yes. Good. Easier to obscure your part in his death than hers. Nerel, the church has been searching for you for quite some time. I'm aware. Such a chill. And so near the hearth. I didn't want this war with you, child. We are enemies of circumstance. 
But circumstances can change. Why are we here, Prava? Would you have us beg forgiveness? Perhaps someday. But in this moment, I only ask for peace. Inarius' death cracked the foundation of our faith. Urivar's actions tore those cracks asunder. If the cathedral is to survive, it will need my full attention. And even though you no longer carry the stone, you are not relieved. The threat of the Lord of Hatred remains. Yes. Yes, it does. Then we have a shared enemy. Let our feud be over. In time when word spreads, you, all of you, will be friends of the Church once more. I swear it. May the Father's light shine on us all. A friend of the Church? Lorath won't know what to do with himself. Are you okay? Yes. I was just thinking about something Eru told me once. You must remember the home you saved. Hold it close to your breast. Because... It's the only thing you have. You have saved more than one home, my friend. Not everything he told you was a lie. Why did he do it? Did... did we push him to this? No, this is on Mephisto. I know how he walks. He shows us truths so deep and terrifying that it makes us question our choices. Ourselves. Our friends. If he can make us hate who we are, his work is nearly done. That's what he's been doing to us all this time. But it didn't work on you. And because of that, I am free of the stone. And we are standing here together. Ready to face whatever comes next. Nairal, promise me something. Anything. When we find Mephisto, you let me be the one to kill him. We are all villains in someone else's story. The Haradrim know this better than anyone. We've all made hard choices to protect what we love. Choices that seem necessary, even righteous, in the moment. But the Lord of Hatred excels at turning the blade of righteousness back into our guts just to hear us scream. The choices we made in Hell had aftershocks we are only now beginning to understand. How would history paint us for the path we'd taken? How would it paint Eru? Eru made his choice out of love and despair. I can hate him and still understand why he did it. And how it made him the devil's perfect tool. Another twist to the blade of righteousness. Perhaps Eru believed it was all worth it. The Hansu and the Spirit Realm were spared from Mephisto's touch. But that only meant they were cursed to watch the rest of the world wither. In the age of hatred to come. Oh. 
In the guise of man, I shall walk amongst the innocent, and there will be no salvation in the light.